So right here is the latest invention that we have. It's the Hydra 17A. And I have set it up with a laser this morning. I'm not 3D printing. I'll be doing that this afternoon. And uh, you can see the laser head, the mirror systems align. And uh, I need to make some parts out of this 8-inch plastic. So I will go ahead and... Uh, so this really makes uh, this particular part much easier to make on the laser. I've been machining these on the CNC and the problem is holding the, the uh, plastic down. Usually we use a double sided tape. Uh, but then it's a pain in the neck to get the tape removed. So, uh, you can imagine how that's not as much fun as it used to be. And we can come right up to the edge, as you can see here. Uh, it runs at a fairly good clip. I'm running it with the door open just so you can see it better, but I like to have it with the door closed. We'll come on up and look through here. Have an amber uh, cover on this, as you can see. That's so I can run the blue laser as well. Now, I also have an engraving job I need to do. So, uh, we'll come over here to the power supply. You can see that it's running uh, 12 milliamps or so. So, that's about 45, 40 watts, something like that. It's not super spectacular but it gets the job done and at that uh, level it should uh, you know have a very long um, life for the tube and that's really a concern although it's not very difficult to change the tube or anything we have integrated cooling that we put in I can pop this open and you can see from underneath there you can see that there's a cooling fan that we've installed so we don't have a bucket of water or any of that nonsense. It cools itself while it's running. And, uh, yeah, it's done. All right, so let's see what it looks like. Let's see how it came out. And uh, you can see that the parts cut right out fine. The holes did too. There's just the paper on the back side cleaned a little bit. So you can see that it comes right out and right through it. All right. Save me a lot of time making that part. Have a great day.